We're gonna work on some gentle core strengthening. Core strength helps stabilize your spine and your low back. So if you're having low back um, pain or discomfort, this can help. So what we're gonna first start out doing is some pelvic tucks. So I'm starting out laying on the ground with the soles of the feet on the ground and the knees are up. I'm just gonna tuck my hips. So I'm tugging the hips, pushing my low back into the floor and then I'm arching that low back. So it's fairly subtle. Exhale, tuck the hips. Inhale, arch the back. Exhale, tuck the hips. Inhale, arch the back. Next time we tuck our hips, we're gonna hold that. Like you're trying to glue your low back to the floor. And then you're gonna pull in your pelvic floor. So starting at the lowest point, um, pull in and up and then start to squeeze those legs together. Holding that, so I'm still breathing, but my low back is pushing into the floor, my legs are squeezing, and my pelvic floor is pulled in. Hold that for about four, five, 10 seconds, and then relax everything. The next one I'm gonna show you is one that's gonna be a little bit more challenging. So we're pushing the low back into the floor, squeezing the legs together, pulling in that pelvic floor. I'm keeping all of that engaged and I'm just gonna raise my feet off the ground so my shins are parallel. This is making my core work a little bit more. Hold that for five to 10 seconds and then bring the soles of the feet to the ground and relax everything. We're gonna do one more. So we're gonna push the low back into the floor, pull in your pelvic floor, Squeeze those legs together, keep all of that engaged, and this time we're gonna reach the feet straight up towards the ceiling. So I'm pushing my heels towards the ceiling. I'm still pushing my low back into the floor, still breathing, hold that for about five to 10 seconds, and then relax everything. You can do like three to five rounds of each of those, and that'll help build some strength and stability.